I bought this uh, flip uh, minnow HD uh, this is the third generation with uh, image stabilization I bought it at Best Buy online for $45 free shipping and I understand you can probably get it for less uh, than 45 at some other places but they might charge you shipping and with Best Buy I know I can return it to a brick and mortar store if I have to uh, if something goes wrong with it so when I first got this uh, the first problem or I thought it was a problem anyway was uh, the charging of the battery uh, you have to use your computer to charge it uh, unless you buy an accessory uh, adapter for $25 or so which I'm not going to do uh, anyway when you first plug it in the light on this side is supposed to light up which it did but then uh, nothing happened uh, because in the menu it says uh, the software is going to lower itself and then uh, you can uh, you can operate it but uh, nothing happens the computer didn't recognize the uh, camera so I waited for it to charge uh, four hours three hours and after maybe about half an hour both sides of the uh, lights came on indicating I guess it was charging and um, the software ran and uh, and then it seemed to be okay but when I unplugged it and look at the battery uh, indicator it was only a quarter charged so I was a little disappointed um, I plugged it back in for another four hours and uh, when the light charging light went out I took it out and looked at it uh, the second time around at work uh, it took a full charge I had a full green bar on the battery level so it worked from then on um, for the uh, charging to work your, your PC or your computer has to be uh, on it, it cannot hibernate uh, this I know from my other uh, flip camera so I was afraid it wasn't gonna work but it did and when the uh, camera is fully charged no the, the light goes out so this is how you know okay so that's the flip uh, minnow HD third generation uh, it's plugged into the TV set uh, with the HDMI cable you need a special uh, HDMI cable because the flip has a micro adapter I bought the cable in Hong Kong for about maybe eight dollars so that plugs into your TV and this is uh, the footage uh, that I shot uh, a minute ago um, with the flip uh, the new version of it uh, the frame rate is uh, much higher uh, is 60 uh, frame frames per second instead of uh, 30 or so uh, the only thing is you're not going to see the difference uh, in uh, quality on YouTube uh, even if you set it to a high quality setting of 720p uh, for viewing I'm going to turn it on and uh... so this is how it looks on on my plasma TV so this is the actual footage I shot with uh, this new camera of my backyard It's supposed to be better than the old flip, which uh, I'm using now to shoot to shoot this uh, video. And this is the 15 watt amorphous panel. This is working out to be okay too. 
Okay, let's so skip this. My, uh, okay, this is another video I shot with the new camera. Testing. This is just a test to see what's going on. It's not charging. I'm going to see why. This is the windmill that I have, I have in my backyard. I just took it down to uh, have it uh, reconfigured. So that's the uh, kind of quality uh, you get with a flip minnow. Uh, you might say, well, I can use my iPhone or, or whatnot, but uh, I don't have an iPhone. Uh, this is $45. I, I do have... Uh, some old uh, video cameras with tapes and uh, and uh, mini tapes or DV tapes or what have you. But this is the camera that I took to China and I had it in my pocket all this time. Uh, all the time I was there and uh, I was able to shoot a lot of footage. Uh, maybe the new one is better, I don't know. But for $45, I'm not gonna, I'm not going to worry about it. Uh, the only problem, like I said, was uh, the battery charging part might be a little uh, pain in the neck because you cannot take the bat battery out and it is not easily uh, replaceable. But if something goes wrong, well, you can just uh, buy another one. If you can, because uh, I think Cisco is... Uh, is doing away with uh, the uh, video camera business. So uh, if you want to buy one, you probably have to buy one soon because uh, you won't be able to pick one up uh, in a year or two. Um, I guess that's all I have to say. I uh, Is it a flip or a, a flop? So, uh, in conclusion, I think it's a good deal. It's, uh, it's a flip, not a flop, uh, as long as it works. I mean, for $45, uh, I don't think you can get anything that is HD, uh, pretty solid quality, good picture, small. I think uh, I think it's it's pretty good for the price, no matter how you look at it.